Mm-hmm. Hi everyone. <laughs> How's your morning? Mine is fantabulous. So I'm making this video to address Jelango because I don't want to write long text on my Insta story. Just say it once and for all. So you can read my lips. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to be a sober, respectful. I've never made a, a video addressing anyone. It's my first time and my last one I never do it but <sighs> what you did I don't care how rude your follow up video was was low demeaning disrespectful period okay so you invited us to your home number one I was sick I didn't even want to go Okay, so I remember it was like, ah, babe, it took a buyer to invite you kwa mtu home. Kwake, kwa privacy yake na, hakuna tu tunafanya, alafu tukose kuenda. Weji kakamua tuende. So I was like, ah, okay, fine, let's go. I, I don't know, I was 50-50. Yani, uh, me, my instincts. Ata na kumuka nichelewesha, kila mtu. My instincts tu zika kuanga tu, very right. So we go there. <laughs> no matter the situation, eh? if you've invited me, I think that means that you you trust me enough that me I never even knew you had kids. To be honest, imagine if I went and took a photo with your kids, then posted it online because you've never posted because that's your private space, and I respect your private space, okay? And I remember your kids are smart beautiful and stuff i would have taken a photo and posted me ah, but then i made my kids but i didn't do that because i'm in the limelight i know when someone chooses not to have a certain thing of theirs not put out there they have their own reasons they're protecting some some sort of their peace so i need to respect that you know ha. fast forward you said what you said and you're not sorry about it Arabo, everyone knows Arabo is the least and problematic person. That's wrong with him. He's not dramatic. At least I know. He's not dramatic. He's never had scandals. He's never had drama. So if you see him responding to someone, it's because they've touched a, 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 a live wire that they shouldn't touch. And yes, you have your people coming through for you, gassing you up. At this point, it's Jalango 10, not in Arab boy 1. 1, because it's Jalango versus Arab. So I'm on Team Arrow, so it's 1. All right. People are gassing you up. But I don't care how many people gas you up. Whatever you did was wrong. It was just outright wrong. Just, that was wrong, to be honest. If it was a blogger or someone, <laughs> and a promoter, or... Uh, uh, like a fan I wouldn't even care but you invite to your personal space so that you can open your mouth then the least the, the next thing that follows is you trying to justify it and say you're not sorry you should ask yourself Arabo doesn't pick fights but he's offended me I'm offended but me if I ever meet you I'm gonna tell you my peace of mind one on one We've been through a lot. We have our own reasons as to why we keep our things to ourselves. We have our angel. Ah, I don't want In heaven. So you should have picked your... I don't want to cry. I, 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 I don't want to... Mm -mm. You should have picked your phone, called Arrow Boy, and asked him, Hey, mbona watu wanasema hivi? What you have to say, bro? Nataka tukujua nini? Because you never know why people do certain things. Especially if you, if it's fans. I mean, people have been talking, people have been insulting. And um, we don't care. We don't. Because sisi mimi na yetu najua. The nigga lost his safari and lost his dad last year. Two people in a year. So what she did, I don't care if the public thinks you're right, was low, cheap. 
God bless you guys.